what's going on you guys it's your boy rbg aka the random black gamer here to bring you guys a let's play on dragon ball xenoverse the beta edition yeah yeah so this is it guys this is what we've been waiting for we have been waiting to get our hands on this beta and test it out for the us release and the euro release so if you guys have the beta, rejoice, and if you guys don't have it, I'm sorry, I apologize. I'm not going to be sarcastic and say boo-hoo, even though I just did. But yeah, we have the beta, and if you guys don't have the beta, I'm pretty sure there's a generous person out there, a generous soul that's willing to give you guys a sock puppet account and share it with you during like via game share so you can try to experience it. But yeah, this right here is the creation feature, the Namekian, we're going to be playing with him, and the name is going to be Random Black Gamer. So I'm gonna type my name in. I like to do it lowercase and big case because I'm a big nut case and I'm random. So random black gamer it is. Damn, I sound like Triple H. I am the game. When I step into the ring of Xenoverse, you will bow down to me. Bow down to the king. I'm gonna be a Namekian because that's the closest like race up in Dragon Ball Z that I see to black race. Uh, even Pycon, he looks more like a black dude. Maybe they're gonna have the Pycon lips on here. Let's see. Does Pycon even have a race? I think he's the greenest black dude. All right, but let's let's just see. Let let's just see what we got here. So I'm gonna go and mess with my appearance a little bit. The, can I get here? Okay, I get the. Does this mean that the Namekian race is turned on when their antennas go up? Like, that gotta mean something. Look at that. I like how shiny this dude is, though. Look how shiny and buff he is. No homo. He looks kind of delicious. I ain't gonna lie. His skin looks shiny. He looks like a Jolly Rancher. Pop the Jolly. I'm sweating. Oh, snap. They got the Mohawk. Like a Sunny Delight green version. Like that tropical Sunny Delight. Like a Savage Dragon. Look at that. We got a Shark Boy right here. So this is what the Namekian race would look like if they had like evolved more, basically like like they're the next step of evolution. You got the evil looking Namekian. That's gonna be like the King Piccolo look right there, like throwback. You got the horns. It's cool. This looks cool though. I like that. I wonder if I'm gonna be able to mess with the skin a little bit. Cause I like that look, that fin. I'm gonna go with the the turned on Namekian look. The hard on, the hard on antennas. <laughs> Alright, for the eyes, not that much to go by. Everything pretty much looks the same. He looks like Piccolo on every shot. You know, like Piccolo on Ecstasy right here. Piccolo when he's being serious. Piccolo when he's being persuasive and talking to Gohan, telling him that he should trade more and wear his booties and his Turbinators more. Alright, uh, I'm gonna go with these right here. I'm gonna go with the Asian persuasion eyes with the little pupils. Okay, I can change the pupils. I'm tripping. All right, for the pupils, um, damn, that's, that looks beast. That looks beast. <laughs> All right. Uh, I'm gonna go with the, the neutral size pupil, pupils. And for the nose, all right, now that's evil Piccolo. That is evil Piccolo to the teeth right there, like young evil Piccolo, because you remember you had that nose you know what I'm saying? He was like, I'm gonna rule this world. I'm gonna wipe out all you pathetic humans. Look at that. See how my nose is scrunched down because I look down upon you and I smell your pathetic stench whimpering from your butt. Yeah. I like that. I might just keep the outfit how it is, too. Like, the Namekians, they got fly outfits and stuff, and they got all the different accessories. He got gloves and all that. Even, the, like, the Namekian muscle structure looks like it can double as an outfit. Like, he got the... Man? Okay, open face. Now, he, I don't know if he got, like, his facial tan on. I don't know if he got that Noxzema on. He trying to make sure he get them pimples off right there. Look at that. He got vitiligo. Look at that booty chin. Looking like the crimson chin right there. Yeah, that that that's evil Piccolo. That's what we going. We going for King Piccolo. Deuce Piccolo, American Gigolo. Yeah, he looks like somebody who just woke up on the wrong side of the uh, whatever they sleep on. So for the colors, for the eyes. 
I'll make my eyes green. Like, or, like even though all the Namekians pretty much have those black eyes, with the exception of King Piccolo, I think I think King Piccolo has black eyes, but I'm not sure. I think he's just a demon, though. You know, he's always been portrayed as the demon King Piccolo. Before they actually, you know, solidified which race he was up in the Dragon Ball universe, which was just evil King Piccolo. And before he became Mud Jr., also known as Piccolo Jr., he was known as the Warrior Piccolo. Alright, man, um. Uh, let's put him in black. Yeah, like, like evil black. How about it? Let's put a smile on their face. Yeah, I'm gonna deck my dude out in black. No, black and gold. Put him in that royal, that royal attire, man. Like that was always my school color. Like we had the warriors. Yeah, black. Everything gotta be black. All black, everything. He Trinidad James right now. I'm liking them shoes though. That's different from Piccolo's shoes. He doesn't have that overhead swish over, like that fold over look to him. I'm digging that. Man, it, this game, like, I got a feeling that this game is gonna have some promising features though. Like, seriously, like, they have, like, Dimps, they've been listening and they pretty much just gone on the record and said that this is gonna be a masterpiece. I hope they, they stay true to their word. Like, I really do. I want my shoes to be gold. I love gold! Alright. So everything seems to be on points. Uh, I don't think you can mess with the voice. Why can't I mess with the voice? I want to have that voice like he had up on that Budokai Tenkaichi 2, like start screen, that start menu, like when you press start, he's like, Dragon Ball Z Budokai Tenkaichi 2. Sorry to keep you waiting. You know what I'm talking about. Alright, so we got that out the way. So, yeah, just a heads up, guys. I kind of got a feel for the game. Like the first time around, I did a pre-recording session. I might upload that. I just wanted to go ahead and take it, you know, take my time with it and kind of get more familiar with it just so I can navigate through everything smoothly because through all the stuff that I started off with, it it was kind of sloppy. I have to admit, everything was mushy, everything was mashy. The connection wasn't up to par. You know, like I had to go to work earlier today and I was on the lookout for this beta because it was promised that it was going to be opened up at 5 a.m. So I don't know if they broke their promise or if the floodgates just got too full with people trying to squeeze in and get their taste of what the game had to offer. But I had to go to work at 8 a.m. 8 a.m. this morning and I had to leave an hour, an hour prior to work, you know, because I have a 45 minute drive. So I only had two hours to play the game and I didn't get, a, get those hours to play the game. I can't talk today. My words are just slipping all over the place. Slippity slip. Slippage. Slippage. Sound like Professor Ward from Hey Arnold. Yeah, I didn't get a chance to play the game because I had an hour prior to play it. But I'm actually going to try to give you guys a, a good demonstration on what you get a chance to do. And we have been summoned by the also powerful trunks of the Time Patrol universe. Let's go to the future! And just a heads up guys, I am going out of my way to give you guys the best quality possible. As you can see right there, Random Black Gamer and all this gold and glory. He looks like the Gold Ranger from Power Rangers CEO. It's time for a gold rush. Yeah, but these right here are just default avatars, like people that are just there. For some reason, I cannot interact with them. Like, I've been trying to interact with people all day. Like, how can I challenge people? You won't let me challenge anybody. Tell me how can I, tell me how can I fight and punch in his face. I want to see you die. Yeah, but this is what it's going to look like essentially when you go to the multiplayer login. You're going to just see random people popping in everywhere. You, you guys are familiar with the Japanese beta and the Euro beta by now. You pretty much know how everybody is. You know, they're going to jump in. You're going to see random pop-ins and stuff like that. But, yeah, this this is it. Like, this is pretty much what everything has to offer. Yeah, and like I said, I'm just trying to give you guys the best quality. So, I took it upon myself to go ahead and take the uh, 
what do they call that the HDCP protection off of my PlayStation 3 because PlayStation they have this kind of caption lock in to where you had to play at 30 to 24 24 to 30 frames per second so I went ahead and got my HD converter out and like um tried to do the HDCP bypass so we can play in smooth with 30 frames per second or how many games you know how many frames this game has to offer so we're gonna go over here to this guy and we're gonna get a match going and we're gonna play on a similar level I'm gonna go for the same level this is everything that you get to do in English this is what we had to see I, I don't even know how these guys like the other guys I don't know how the other guys got a. Uh, hold on, that's a parallel quest. Okay, I'm gonna go to a match first. Yeah, like to the people that got the Japanese beta and who are able to kind of navigate around everything without knowing how to, you know, translate and read all that stuff. Kudos to you, because I wouldn't have been able to have the patience to do that. Like, sirs, seriously, sirs. Alright guys, we are back and we found somebody to fight. Let's see if he's ready. I hope he just presses ready. Just press ready, please. Please, pretty please. Okay, alright, awesome. Awesome. Let's go. Like I said, if you guys bump into me online and you happen to see a video that looks similar and you think it's you, please let me know in the comment section below. Basing on if you kick my ass or if you get your ass kicked. I know I'm going to turn your butthole into some house shoes. I think this is a random match too, so this guy might be a little stronger than me. Got that baby Gohan with the innocent eyes. Got the Macaulay Kogan eyes, boy. Alright. Yes. Be amazed at my golden... There you go. Damn it. Okay. Come on, come on. Yeah, this guy, he's been playing for a while. Yeah, he's been playing. Oh, my goodness. He got me with my own move. Good game. Good game. Oh, my. <laughs> I sunk through the floor. That's cool. That's cool. So, I just got my butthole handed to me. So, I'm just going to end this video right here. I hope you guys enjoyed it and be on the lookout for some more videos till I get a hang of the game. Anyways, this is your boy RBG signing out. I just got my butt handed to me by my own finishing move.